Hi guys, it's June Simmons with Online Sales Pro, and tonight is my night 81 of the Vincent Ortega Jr. 100 Day Video Challenge, and it's 4.30 in the morning, I worked tonight, and um, uh, so yeah, it's real late, but we were we were doing booster post and for day 31 of the facebook blueprint training and so um today we're going to do we're going to continue on with that and it's going to be managing your boosted posts and so after you've boosted a post here's how you can manage your budget edit posts and keep an eye on how it's performing so once you've boosted your post it's important to monitor how well your content performs. If you need to make adjustments to the schedule or budget, you can easily make those changes. You can manage all of these in the post itself, in Ads Manager, and in the Power Editor. So you view your, boost, your boosted post performance. At the bottom of your boosted post, you will see an orange bar. You can hover over the bar you can see the total number of unique people that you have seen that have who have seen your post either on your page or on their news feed organic reach is the number of people who have seen your post in news feeds or on your page's timeline after you boost a post on your page the number that represents organic reach might go down this is because these people who saw your page post before it was boosted and then saw your post again after it was boosted are now counted toward paid reach. Paid reach is the number of people who have seen your post through an ad. You can also see how your boosted post is performing by clicking on the orange bar at the bottom of the boosted post you'll see in more detail in more, more detailed breakdown, including engagements, metrics, likes, shares, comments, and so on. Keep in mind that sometimes your boosted post won't reach the number of people initially indicated. The reach you see when, you're, when you boost your post is an estimate and may be affected by other boosted posts running at the same time. If there are more boosted posts, boosted page posts running than estimated when the boost, when you boosted your post, the price will increase and reach will decrease. In any case, you will only be charged for the actual reach of your promotion. Also, boosting a post post that has been apt targeted to a specific location or language may also reduce your reach. Okay, edit text in a boosted post. Once a page post has been boosted, you can edit the content without pausing or deleting the boost. But you can pause the boost, edit the post, the text only, not the image, and then and then unpause your post. To pause the boost, select boosted for at the bottom right of the boosted post. Select pause in the bottom right corner of the window that appears. Select pause to confirm. Oh, sorry. Select pause to confirm. Your boost will then stop, and the bottom right of your post will say boosted pause. Boost paused. And then you can edit your post. Hover over the post. Select the down arrow in the top right corner and then select edit your post. Edit your boost. Edit your post and select done editing. Keep in mind that you can edit the text but you won't be able to change the image that you originally uploaded to the post. Oh goodness, after editing your post, click on the boost pause at the bottom right and select resume. Once you resume a pause a pause boost then you'll continue to pay until 
you've used the total budget that you set. You can edit your budget. There are three ways that you can edit your boosted post budget from the post itself in Ads Manager and Power Editor. To increase budget directly from the post, go to the post and hover over the amount left in your budget at the bottom right. Click the box next to Add Budget to select an amount from the drop down menu. Click Add Budget. To decrease the budget directly from post, go to the post, hover over the amount left in your budget at the bottom right, and click on the settings icon in the bottom left of the window, press delete and confirm delete boost. Click boost post then enter your new budget. Click boost to reboost your post at the new budget. Oh. Huh. Okay. The new budget. In the ads manager, you can select campaigns. In the left column, select ad sets. Go to the row of posts you want to edit, hover over the budget column and select the pencil looking thing to edit and budget schedule. And then select save. Select add. Go to the row of posts that you want to edit. Select your post in the add column and select edit. Edit creative to change your targeting and price and select save. From the power editor, select add sets at the top, select the row of the post that you want to edit, then edit your budget and schedule in the workplace. Select add at the top, select the row of the post you want to edit and select audience in the workspace to change your audience. Select upload changes at the top. Okay. Tomorrow we're going to go on edit, targeting, and schedule. I'll write that down, so... Edit, targeting, and schedule. That's what we'll do tomorrow. Okay. Alright. Yeah, it's just so late. I don't want to wake up. Ooh, I don't want to wake up anybody, so I better end for tonight, but, okay, thanks for watching, I'll be back tomorrow for day 82 of the Vincent Ortega Jr. 100 Day Video Challenge, and day 32 of the Facebook Blueprint, and so, see you back here tomorrow, have a great day by now, <laughs> uh, I'll be back later on tonight, I guess, really, alright, have a good one.